Hey everybody, Zenith here. I wanted to talk to you guys about Warcraft logs and how do I upload them. Because it's one of the things that took me a while to figure out. It's actually not hard at all to do, but it was something that I just felt like, oh, I'll let somebody else in my raid do that when I was first new at raiding. Um, and Warcraft logs is one of the greatest tools that you can use to help improve your performance as a raider, as a raid team. Um, to evaluate how fights are going, to evaluate how the top end players are doing their fights, um, all those types of things. Warcraft Logs is the, is the place to do that. So, and obviously watching videos, the kill videos and things like that on YouTube, those can also help because you can literally see the video being recorded. But um, you can evaluate fights through Warcraft Logs as well, but it's not the same as a video. Now, so how do I do this? What do I do? What do I need to have? It's really actually quite easy. You just have to download the Warcraft Logs uploader. I believe that you can download that through the Warcraft Logs website, um, warcraftlogs.com. And once you've got that downloaded, um, you're going to be able to record logs and upload those logs online to the website. And so how do we do that? How do we do that in game? It's actually very easy. The only thing you need to make sure you have enabled is going to be under System, Network. Make sure you have checked Advanced Combat Logging. If you don't have that checked, you can't use Combat Logging. Hit OK. And then when you're going to log, you can do logging in two ways. You can live log or you can just log and then upload it once you have the time to do it. Um, Live logging means it tracks it live and it's uploading it and responding live as each boss dies. It's uploading immediately. Um, and that would be done using live logging. Otherwise, you can just record your log data. And when you're done, or if you only want to record, list up certain fights, um, you can upload those through combat logging. So if you type in the game slash combat log, it begins logging and begins recording your data. So as soon as you type that, you go into a fight and anything, any bosses that you fight in the time that you started logging or enabled logging, it'll record. Once you're done logging or you're done with the fight, you just type combat slash combat log again. It turns it off so it's not still constantly recording and it saves this data into a combat log folder which you can specify. It's typically in your regular WoW directory. And when you want to upload those, you just go into the app, which you have to log into. You have to create an account, which is free. I um, mean, you choose upload a log. It's going to say this is where it probably is. More than likely, it's going to be in your World of Warcraft folder, retail logs. And then typically the standard name is Warcraft log .text, um, or WoW combat log .text. And then from there, you can enter like the name of what you want it to be. You can make your logs private if you don't want other people to see them. You can make them public. You can do all those types of things through here. Um, and then you'll hit go. It'll search that folder, try and find any logs that were recorded in that folder that it listed above. Um, if you put your logs somewhere else, make sure you specify the new folder. And it'll scan through all the, all the logs you've recorded. And then you'll see this list of, of bosses. Now, I haven't cleared my logs in a while, so there's a bunch of fights that are listed. And so in here, you can see, what do I want to list? Well, let's say I want to list this heroic kill of one of the heroic bosses. And this, this so if you want to do that and you control and click, you can say, I want this kill, I want this kill, I want this kill, I want this kill. I don't want to record my wipes. You can if you want to, but most of the time I don't because... It's not really that beneficial. And then you would hit go. And when you hit go, it would upload them. Now, I've already uploaded these, so I don't really need to. But I'll go ahead and hit go anyway. So it's going to read them, and it's going to upload them to the website. And once it's uploaded them to the website, you can clear out your logs. So that you don't have, like I did, where I had 15 you know, different logs that were still recorded because I hadn't cleared out my data. And I'll show you how you do that. Once it's done uploading here in just a minute, or a second, whatever. 
Okay, so it's completed. Now, if you want to look at your logs, you click Review Report. It takes you to the website, lets you look at the logs that you have. So if we click that, it takes me to Warcraft Logs. Let's me see, hey, here are the fights that I performed on. We had Mythic Jade Fire, or I'm sorry, Heroic Jade Fire. So I was right here. I was in the top. We had some really good players during this fight. Um, so this is where, this is all the fights that I had recorded um, that I chose to upload. So they're listed right here. Um, the button you would click to clear your logs is delete the combat text. This will remove them. If you want to store them somewhere else, you can archive them. I haven't ever done that. I'm not that hardcore about it. But you can delete them right here by clicking this. Sometimes it won't delete if the game is currently running. So I'll say OK. You have to log out of World of Warcraft to delete them. So I need to get closer. Exit game. Once you log out, delete combat text. Successfully deleted. Okay. And that is, in a nutshell, how you upload logs.